case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In the 1979 Supreme Court case Dunaway v. New York, the fundamental issue at stake was that police must have probable cause to arrest someone, and if they obtain a confession after illegally detaining and interrogating a suspect, the confession may be deemed inadmissible in court. The case arose when the petitioner was detained and questioned by the police without probable cause after being implicated in a robbery and murder. Although the police lacked enough evidence to arrest him, they still ordered his arrest and questioning. The petitioner was taken into custody and brought to police headquarters, where he was interrogated and eventually made incriminating statements and sketches. This conduct violated his Fourth and Fourteenth Amendment rights. The admissibility of the evidence obtained during his illegal detention was the key issue in the case. The Supreme Court ultimately decided that custodial questioning without probable cause for a full arrest was illegal and found that the petitioner's incriminating statements and sketches were inadmissible due to the unconstitutional police conduct. The court held that the decision to admit the confession was flawed because it confused voluntariness with the causal connection test from Brown v. Illinois. This admission risked creating a precedent for Fourth Amendment violations by law enforcement. As a result, the decision in Dunaway v. New York was overturned, and Justice Powell recused himself from the ruling. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.